Juliet. Um, I'm here um, with a couple videos. Um, some of these will be late. I don't know if I'll be able to get all of them up tonight. It's already almost 12. But I will get up what I can tonight and then hopefully do the rest like tomorrow or something. So first, um, this one is going to be my, you'll see the title, but this is my Kindle haul, um, and this, these are just the books that I've gotten over the last couple months, um, I think from like December to February, so, um, yeah, let's just get started. Um, okay, the first one is still loading, and that is the first Sandra Rose Clark, The Assassin's Curse. It's the first one. I have the second one in, um, sorry about the glare. I have the second one in paperback in physical form, but, and I had ordered this one first in paperback from Amazon, but, um, it was taking, like, forever to come, like, it took forever for them to even ship it. They never actually did, so I canceled the order, and then I hadn't been able to find another one, so, um, I, I got the second one, and then when I still couldn't find the first one, I saw that they had it as a Kindle book, um, ebook, so I got that instead, so I can still read both of them, um, so that's gonna be good, I've been looking forward to those, I can't wait, and then I got um, cause I've been hearing it everywhere, and my older sister, for my next book, is, uh, has already read, like, four of them, and loves them, like everyone else, so, it's the movie cover, and it's just a Kindle edition, but I thought, since they're so big, and so expensive, I would just get the first one as, a uh, ebook, and then, once I read it, and if I love it, like everyone else, I'll get them, collect them all, and paper back. Um, and also, I thought it would be less intimidating to have it as an e-book. And that's the Outlander book, with the movie cover, or the TV show cover. And that's, everyone knows what this is about, by Dana Gab. Bolden, um, I think the, I first heard about this on, oh shoot, what's her name, um, shoot, not Cassidy, ah, oh, I can't remember her name all of a sudden, um, but yeah, she was an extra in Divergent. Anyway, I'll, I know I'll think of her name as soon as I'm done with this video, but, oh well. And then I also got the Secrets and Lace, which is the second book in the Lady Lace series. Um, it looks like that. I haven't read it. I've read the first one, though, which was Spurs and Lace. And then I really don't even remember which ones, how many I've gotten since the last haul. Um, but another book is Call of, Call of the Herald, and it's book one by Brian Ruthburn. And then Pushing the Limits, which is the first Katie McGuire book I have. I have the sequel to Pushing the Limits in hardback, which I got really cheap at 
hauled that before. Um, I haven't read e either of them. Then I also have uh, Sky Hunter by Chris Rayern, which is, um, I think it's sci fi dystopian book. And I also have Mark of the Mage, which is fantasy, and I don't even remember what most of these are about. Um, and that's by RK, RK something, it's book one. I can't read the last name because my thing's covering it. Then I also have Loving Lauren by Jill Sanders, which most of these are free, or if they weren't, they were no more than five dollars. Most of them are way under that. Uh, some of them, like Outlander, and some of the um, bigger named ones that I spent more on, um, but not too much. They've all been pretty good. Then I got. Fatal Network, because I've been really into crime shows. Um, I've never really read crime books, and I love crime shows, so I thought that it would be nice to have a couple to read. And that's by Trevor Scott. And then The Fallen Star, I think I've had that on for a while. That's by Jessica Surin. And another crime novel is uh, Quinn Chick checks in, and it's part of a series, and it's by L.H. Thompson. Then I got The Flirting Games, book one of the Flirting series by Stella Wilkinson. It's just cute like that. Sorry about the glare. And then I have Lost and Found by Nicole Williams, which I think I've had on and hauled before. Oh, you can see me um, or see yourself. The glare is so bad. Then I also got The Good Night by Sarah Woodberry. Another fantasy book. Uh, Sworn to Rise by Tyr Eden, which is another fantasy book. Then Opposing Sides by C.M. Dubro. I thought that was free, but now I'm not sure that was, and I think it's the one I've heard negative things about. Uh, Killer Cupcakes by Leon Dobbs. I think I've called that already. Oh, jeez. Really can't see. Um... And then, A Dragon's Tale by Sydney Breeding, which is fantasy and time travel. Um, and obviously romance, as you can see. Then, Amethyst, which is book one of the Guardian series by Heather Bohe. Can't remember what that's about. I think it's dystopian. And then, Beautiful Chances by Alyssa Ray. Sorry, I'm butchering the name. And you can't see a dang thing. Um, the Dark Cathedral by Michael Wallace, which is also a fantasy book. Then, Twenty Eight and a Half Wishes by Denise Grover Swank. It looks like it might be another, like, crime book. Oops. I just completely ran that. Okay. Then I have the sample of Maggie's, Steve Otter's, The Raven Boys. And a couple diet books. Uh, Ranger's Tale, which I think I've already hauled. And, of course, Sangro, which I read last summer. By Mystic Parker, which is fantasy, and then Planet Yours by Jennifer and Christopher Nathan. 
uh, which is also fancy. And then Last Train Home, which is book one in the Home series, and that's by Megan Isabel. And then I got Hidden, which is book one of the Dragonland series, and that's by Mary Jensen. And I got In Her Name from Chaos Born, which is another fantasy, by Michael R. Hicks. And I got by Elliot, Anna Elliot, Georgiana Darcy's Diary, Pride and Prejudice Continued, which I thought was cool. I think that one was free. And then I got Enchanted. An Unfortunate Fairy Tale by Chanda Han. The Diet Book. Then Book One of the Freak House series, The Wrong Girl by C.H. Archer. Another Diet Book. A couple more. Then I got The Breeders Book Three by Katie French, which I didn't know there was a book three. I haven't read it yet. Um, dystopian. Kind of frightening and the covers are so creepy. And then I got the novella Nessa's story. It's the novella of the um, readers books. And then I have the Defy, which I've heard is really good. I do know I paid for that one. Um, some of them distinctly remember paying for and often remember how much but not always, and then most of the time I just don't remember I paid, because most of them I count for free. Um, but anyway, Defy, I've been one to read, like, I've had it on my wish list, and it's not one I just stumbled across. It's one that I've been hearing about and have been wanting for a while, so. Defy, that's kind of see, it's like about assassins, I think. And then, I love this cover, uh, if you can see it, Ugh. Land of Shadows by Jeff Dunville, and then, that one was free, I'm pretty sure, and then the, the beginning, the beginning of everything, everyone gets a tragedy by Raven Skinner, Snyder, I'm not sure. Then, Her Christmas Bonus, a short story by Rain Danvers. And then, I'm really excited about this one, too. I love the cover. Um, but I, that one's so cheap. I do want to get this one in physical form, because it's just so pretty. But I thought I'd read it first and see if I liked it. Well, it was cheap. And that's meant to be by Lauren Morell. It's just so pretty. Oops, no, no, no. And then also, I've been wanting to read this one for a while, and I'm really excited that. And that's Branded, the Sinner series by Abby Kettner and Missy. I have no idea how you say her last name. Then I also got. Uh, a selection novella, The Prince, by Kira Cass. Oops. Well, and I also got uh, Just Breathe uh, by Heather Allen. I think it's a mermaid book. I never read any mermaid book. Um, then Goddess Legacy. Oh. The last one is by Heather Allen. The Goddess Legacy is by M.W. Muse. I think I've hauled it before. It's about goddesses and stuff. And then Forbidden the Stars by the uh, Valmore Daniels. And I think I've hauled those before. Yeah, I think all these other ones I've already hauled. Um, 
yeah, I believe those were the all the new ones. So I hope, and at least I hope so. Otherwise, I really need to make this uh, more. Not wait so long between hauls because that was crazy. Um, and I'm not even I'm not even sure like if those were all the ones that I've gotten since the last time I did a um, Kindle haul, but I hope so. Um, so, yeah, and I hope I didn't reshow ones that I already got. I know I probably you caught a little bit of a glimpse, but yeah, so that's all for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Like, comment, subscribe down below if you want to. Um, I would love to hear from you and um, chat, and I hope you enjoyed this. And um, if you've read any of those books I showed you, if you could see them, um, if you've read any of them, let me know down below and let me know your feelings. Just no spoilers, please. Thank you. Um, see you soon in my next video. Bye.